Hello everyone, welcome to Code Black's YouTube channel. In this video, we're going to discuss about how to create a repository. So this is the second video in the GitHub series. In this, I will be guiding you the easiest and simplest way to create a repository and to upload the code files into your repository. So before creating a repository, let me explain you what is a repository. Repository is nothing but it is the place in your GitHub account where all the project files including documentation, readme files, codes, everything is stored and each file's revision history is stored there. If you don't know what is revision history, please watch my initial video about GitHub. So I have explained you about the revision history. There, revision history is one of the biggest feature which GitHub provides. Isn't it sound interesting? You can store your code with the revision history in a virtual place. So you can access it anywhere around the globe, even though your members can access it anywhere around the globe. There are two features about a repository which we need to consider. Initial one is an ownership. The other one is the visibility. Ownership means you can control the people who can contribute to your project. If it is an office work or something or else some highly confidential work, it is always better to keep the ownership private. Or else it is if it is an open source project, you can keep the ownership public so everyone around the globe can contribute to your code. And also visibility can be switched between visible to everyone and without making it visible to everyone. So these are the main two features which you need, th need to think before creating a repository. Okay, now you all know about repository and some important features to be considered. Let's open a repository. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Don't rush because there are two methods in which you can upload your source codes into your GitHub repository. So let me explain that also before I start demonstrating how to do that. Initially, what you can do is you can use the git commands, which is really an easy way. But then using git commands, you can directly choose the code files and upload it to your repository. So these are the two main ways to upload the source code into your repository. But most of the time I prefer direct uploads, but also you can use git commands if you really remember the codes of every time or else when you open a repository itself, the GitHub will guide you on the commands which you need to use in order to push your codes into your github repository don't worry guys i will show a demo on how to open a repository and push your codes into your online repository once you log into your github account this will be your user interface in here you can see your profile details by clicking down this drop down menu opening a github account is not much a big deal because you can use your google credentials or use your email and open an account very easily so once you open an account you can create a repository to save your source codes in it for that you have to press here the green color new button once you press that new button it will take you to a page like this where you can add up your repository details you don't have to do much changes or a big deal here initially the owner will be you so if you are okay with that don't go to change that or else you can change the ownership to the collaborations which you have made with some other partners or other clients and also in the repository name you have to give a proper repository name which you will be able to identify it later on after giving that repository name in the description you can add a description to your source code so once you add the description you can change the visibility as public or as private and also if you want you can add a readme file into it add anything of it if you want you can add those things or else just press the create repository button once you create 
press that button it will take to your page like this in here you can see several methods to upload or as push your source code into your repository which you have created now the easiest way to upload your code or initially is using this uploading an existing file how are you going to do it is just press this one it will take you to a page like this and also what you have to do is just open the page with your code and you can just drag and drop your files into the repository so this method will help you to upload your codes into your repository easily a few moments later once everything has been uploaded you can commit your changes into the repository this is the repository which i created initially under the name login and i have uploaded the codes into it. it will be like this it shows that this is the main branch and i am the owner of it and also you can see the languages which you used here because it shows the percentage of the languages which is used to create the source code so hope this video gave you a good understanding about what is a repository and how to create it and how to add files or source codes into it i am hoping to do a separate video on how to push your codes into your repository using git bash we hope this video was helpful to you all thank you for watching if this is really helpful please like share and if you have anything to share please put it in the comment section thank you for watching